Hello and welcome to another video of Budget Builds PH. My name is Russell and today we will have another Ryzen build. Our build for today is a Ryzen 3 3200G worth 20,000 pesos. Now wait, bakit 20,000 pesos for a Ryzen 3? Kasi meron naman akong video na Ryzen 5 na 20K. Well, let me explain why. Kasi inflation. So the MSRP of this Ryzen 3 3200G should go around 5 to 7K, maybe 6K. But I got this for 10,000 pesos kasi ang daming bumibili ng Ryzen ngayon. Hindi yung Ryzen na walang integrated. Lahat ng mga G-series ng Ryzen ay inflated kasi nga may shortage yung GPU. So madami bumibili ng APU ngayon kaya siya inflated. This should go for 6 pero nakuha ko 10K. But yun ang talaga for a build in this pandemic and a shortage as well. So to keep this video short, all the parts will be listed on screen. You might be wondering bakit ako nakakap. Well, gusto makita? Oh my god! <coughs> what? Hair reveal at 100 likes. Anyway, let's get to the build and with a snap of my finger, we have a PC. Wow, time skip. So in this PC that I built, medyo mabilis. Mabilis yung pagbuo ko dito kasi, you know, maliit lang siya. And it's a white build. It looks nice. Sheesh! Lalo na yung RAM, it's silver, it's metallic. Uh, mag install na ako ng Windows and then we will go directly through the benchmarks. But before we get to the benchmarks, you might be asking, bakit generic power supply? Bakit 250 watts? As you can see from the power supply, it's 250 watts rated power and 700 generic power. So we can say na 250 watts lang yung power supply nito. But wait, the Ryzen 3 3200G will only consume up to 65 watts TDP. And we can add the rest of the components. Maybe we can say 50 to 100 watts. So at total, you only have around 165 watts. Pwede na yun sa generic power supply. But the only time na kailangan mo mag-upgrade ng power supply is when you're gonna add a graphics card. For now, okay lang naman ang generic power supply. Naganda lang yung wattage niya for an AMD APU. Kasi hindi naman power hungry yung mga yan eh. 65 watts TDP lang yan. And you only have a total of 165. So they are fine. It's okay. I'm gonna say it now. Generic power supplies are okay for APU builds. I suggest that you go for an 80 plus bronze certified power supply pag mag upgrade ka na or kung meron ka ng GPU. But for APUs, they are generally low power and generic power supplies are enough. Now we can get to the benchmarks.
There you have it, we have finished our PC build and we have run our benchmarks. Now I papa ship ko na sa kanya and let's see what he thinks. Look at this, check it out. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. Fancy. Oh no, we didn't we didn't buy a screen. What we bought is this little How's the graphics? It's, it's nice. Is it better than my old computer? I'm, it, it's nicer. It's, it's, yeah, it's nicer. It's, Is it faster? Yeah. Why don't you show people around your castle? Why don't you go to the front of the castle and show them what the castle looks like? Why don't you... Why don't you walk to the... Why don't you walk out a little bit and then look back so everybody can see your house. But you like your house? Can you point out where your room is? Did you make that yourself? My dad built the house. This is my dad's kitchen. Bye-bye. Say thank you, James. Thank you, James.